We're looking ahead to a plan that could convert part of the Audubon golf course on Maple Road in Amherst into a cemetery. Two on your sides, Dave McKinley has more on the plan ahead of what could be a pretty heated discussion about it when the town board meets tonight. Dave. Kate, the knowledge that there may be human remains buried somewhere here near the 18th tee at Autobahn isn't new. However, an idea by the town to close half this golf course and turn it into a cemetery is, and it's something about which town board members are expected to get an earful tonight. It all goes back to the 1960s when UB was building out its south campus and remains from a pauper's field near Bailey Avenue, once associated with the nearby county poorhouse, were dug up. The remains were quietly taken to a section of UB-owned land off of Maple Road, which later became the town of Amherst's Autobahn Golf Course. This actually came to light eight years ago, and current town supervisor Brian Culpa thinks it's high time the issue is addressed. Two weeks ago, he announced the concept of taking part of the golf course and selling it to the Forest Lawn Group, which would then make a burial ground for cremated remains only. Because tonight marks the first time the town board has met since that idea was unveiled, he expects there will be no shortage of speakers. Well, generally speaking, the, the, the people who are, have had a conversation with me understand that there isn't a change to golf this year, staring them immediately in the face this spring. And so they're more than willing to have a conversation over the course of a year. The proposal is not on the agenda at tonight's Amherst Town Board meeting, but we do expect to hear about it during the Speak to Council session. At the Autobahn Golf Course in Amherst, Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.